is up everybody it is me jordan fisher 2000 here and first before i start this video please go ahead and subscribe to this guy right here called camcap and because uh he actually skyped me about an issue with converting a 30 fps video to a 60 fps video and i helped him fix that issue but also guys please go ahead and subscribe to my new uh channel called drop that trap right here so i recently just uploaded a brand new release so uh let's go ahead and check it out uh it's a brand new song it's by um it's by prxcm and ray volp so basically this is a remix and it's a very good song i highly suggest you guys go check this channel out it's brand new and i just uploaded this about 26 minutes ago so i will leave the channel link in the description also, please subscribe to CamCat because he actually uh, Skyped me with this issue, but this issue is actually about converting. And you may get this error if you're not, if you are a 32-bit user, then please continue watching. But if you're a 64-bit user, then you can leave because this video does not uh, inform you guys. So if you go to your file manager and you go to your C drive, you can see that some users may not have this folder program files 86 um so that's that's what's causing your issue the code that's set to convert the video is set to this folder but it doesn't actually exist so you want it to go to this folder right here so what you do is you go into me gui you just go open up the application uh i don't really care uh you go click on yes and you come up with this menu right here you go to your tools AVS script creator you go to your profile click on config and you're gonna see that the directory right here is set to program files 86 what you do is you go to where it says 86 go to the parentheses, and then it will take you to where the blinker is where the backslash is you take out the 86 just like this until it looks just like that right here to where the S and the M are touching the slash. Once you do that, you click on update and you click on OK and you basically render out your video. But I'm not gonna do that because I don't uh I don't need to do that. So I'm gonna keep mine like that. I'm going to exit out of it. And once you do that, you just choose your video and you basically just convert it, and that is how you fix the issue. But anyway, that's pretty much it for this tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, please subscribe to my channel and the Drop That Trap Nation channel, and leave a like on this video, and also subscribe to Cam uh, Cat because he helped me out with this video. And this is actually the video that I helped him out with right here. It's called Black Ops 360 FPS Test. Here it is right here. But anyway, that's pretty much it, and peace out.